to carry the momentum towards the playoffs with Bornok making his MPL debut. Here is Smart Omega! Borno! Paano mo masisiguro na hindi makakabawi ang Raiders? Ano ang palag mo? Wala eh. Sumbo ko na lang siya sa kuya ko. <laughs> palag kong palag! Fist bump! So, here comes the zone coming in from Shaknu. Nimbor really wanna cast things. Oh, look at that! Riona goes in first with the Earth Shatter Flicker combination as they bring down Shaknu. Here comes Nimbor with the final slash, Light with the AOG. Riota as well, so against the damage coming in from RSG, but here comes Kose with a blazing duet on Riota and to Jove. A double kill coming in from Aqua and a good start for the Raiders. It's all... That's what RSG is working on right now. Here we go! Oh, look at the Wii Shadow kill and welcome to MPL Vornok. Set up when it comes to the crowd control because of this guy specifically. Irad once again goes in for the Uiki Shadow Kill and finishes the job. Brings down Bornok. What? Out. Shaknu going to his brother next. Forces out the flicker but never catches him with a final slash. A killing spree from Aqua. Earth Chatter, that's it. Your, your only other way out is the Primal. I'll see what I tell oh, you. Oh, here comes the Nimor final slash once again. Onto one of his favorite heroes as oh, Irad goes in with the Uiki Shadow Kill. Bringing the third death of Bornok. Andoria tries to survey the scene. They're chasing after Joe. Big he shuts down Irad. Here comes the brilliant. What? Andoria Templates on Blades. And he's going to bring down Kose as well. All of a sudden, turning around for Omega. But look at Nibber with a final slash catch once again to even out the score. And opening for Omega as they try to zone out their remaining members of RSG and Doryu is here in the Lord Pit as well as Ira. It's gonna be a retribution battle, retribution rumble, and it's gonna oh. go to the mechanic as he secures the very first Lord. Jack to throw so much gonna go Pusay. off to Kose, but there's the BMI out. He is still alive. And RSG just like that, no casualties. But and when they see Nimbor, everyone's just scattering out. They don't want to get caught by the final slash as Ryota pops his Primal Wrath to make sure to burst down the Lord. One inhibitor turret left and Irad is working on it and now the base of Omega fully exposed as Nimbor manages to find Ryota on his Primal what? Wrath form. But here comes the counter attack coming in from Omega. Bornok with a good cast of that skill. Jove goes after Aqua, Aqua and shuts him down. That's three Raiders all of a sudden what? gone. And Endorio also brings down Irad. The potential mistakes that their opponents can do. They have minions here his name board goes for the catch paired up with a uh, blazing duet coming Whoa! in from Jose Lito with AOG this must be the answer coming in from RSG they're gonna bring down Ryota Jack Lewis the next target he has the immortality Nibor making sure to cut his uh, his exit route there as two members will fall down for Omega and Doryu has to walk away here oh wait 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 he's caught up he's oh, caught up here comes the delay coming in from Endoryu might be able to take down Kose but Kose with the winter card as Irad finishes him off it's just Shom and Bornok left a defense of a lifetime is needed for the barangay. The nightmare suffers his own mistakes. Oh. And now they're inside the base. Five seconds before Ryota comes alive. Here comes the final defense. But Kosei says no. And RSG will take game one. A few moments later. It's a super fans community cup. That's cool. <laughs> That's pretty fire. Oh. Substitution! That bit. Yeah. I, I don't that, know. I something forgot. like that, right? More knocks out. And I assume Okir is gonna be in. There you hey. go. We're gonna send out Chaknu. Here comes the movement speed, but look at Neymar with the final slash catch, plus the Oiki shadow kill. Just the damage is enough for RSG, but Adoryu will still get the third as he uses the Temples of Blades. AOG coming in from light, but look at this. Aqua's gonna fall down. Ryota, Okir, and Adoryu. A trade for the turtle. Amazing work here by the Barangay RSG doing their best, and this time, oh. the tables flip. Kusei! Shaknu! What an amazing backdoor play! Cuts off the exit route of Kosei with a taunt! From Irad oh. would have been the... Oh. I see on the cake and here we go! Oh, here comes the diversion of the Barangay bringing every member as they take down Irad. Light is the next oh. target. Ryota will pick him up as Aqua tries to walk away. Catch? It could go south for RSG. Don't regret it!
There's and a diversion no, onto the back, and Chaknu hasn't cast his ultimate yet, but Joan goes in with order and brilliance and brings down Kosei and Aqua. Lord marching in light AOG just to delay Bariota, and Andoryu brings him down. It's going to be a four on two battle. Ira, the mechanic, still alive, dishing out the shurikens as Omega works on the middle lane turret. Look at the damage coming in from Uki, though. Here it has to walk away there. He's not even died once. Oh, the and now diversion. he's gonna get sent back over again. Again, delivery for Omega Chaknu, but look at Joe onto the backline, sending three raiders down to the base as Ukir picks up another kill and Ryota Tower locks. We are going to a Friday game number three. Or for Omega, is they're really trying to avoid where light is? That's exactly. why they keep rotating onto Kosei once again. again. Seems like it's a replay of what happened during the first minute. But here comes Light, though. Okay. They can defend all day. Not just the Lilia. Wow! Oh, no! The what? flicker! What a catch from Ryota! Commits the wild charge flicker combination. Paired up with the AOG coming in from Shaknu. Here comes the defense. Here comes Aqua. Nimbar as well. Spear of Destruction will connect. Four Ooh. members of RSG trying to go for Chuck New Year as he tries to walk away. Nimbar with the stun. Raging Sandstorm going to be committed. Here comes Ryota as well trying to soak up the damage. Adore you with the Templates of Blades going right after the back line. Nimbar is still alive. Aye, aye, but aye, is aye. his offense going to be enough though as Ryota brings him down? Because Omega. Okay, I thought that was a diversion. It was a recall. <laughs> You're remembering game two. Yo! What? But Ryota remembers how to use the Bang. wild charge flicker call. Combination. The shock to go is able to AOG again. Kosei is gonna fall down. Here comes Devor though. Oh. Final slash will connect as Aqua uses the Nether Realm up against four members of Omega. They're in between two turrets, but Omega doesn't care as Endoryu steals away the purple buff. Grand Theft Purple, Highway Robbery, straight in the face of Irad, and now he's Savage B3! Okay, here goes the Tempest of Blades for the catch onto Irad. Irad's gonna fall down, here goes Fear of Destruction though. Andori's still standing tall as Light tries to go right after him. But keeps him alive. Okay, and now, now Omega's gonna make. Oh, another one by Royota! The layering of skills from this team is just too amazing. I mean, that's two ultimates connecting. And a double kill, a two kill, a takedown for Omega as they try to work on Irad. They're like Jaeger pilots from Pacific Rim. They're drift compatible. They're, They're in each other's heads. <laughs> Literally as Andori goes oh! in. Tempest of Blade all of a sudden, Kosei goes down. Wasn't enough time even for the Nether Realm to save Kosei here as Aqua tries to walk away. They're in too deep. Show them all too deep. <laughs> Sandwich got taken down by Aqua here. So that's the very first kill of RSG as Ryota accepts his fate. Just now, and a double kill coming in from Aqua. It's fine. Yeah. How about Joe with the Order and Brilliance? I think it's the same amount of layers you gotta go through. AOG! Speaking of layers, the layers are connecting here for Omega, but again, the inhibitor turret is still there. That's why they're gonna bring down Rio. Here comes Joe answering right back onto Aqua. Aqua has a passive though, so he's now spawned. Tempest of and Doryu chases after Ira, then brings him down, but gets caught up by three. And Kosei finally gets a shutdown, working onto Chaknu here as he pops the revitalized Spear of Destruction. is gonna connect, but a counter attack coming in as they bring down Light. It's gonna be a three on two. They have minions onto the bottom lane. Will Omega finally get a win onto RST? Whoa. Look at the burst from Aqua! Oh. Manages to find one and bring him down and just Kosei left with the Winter Crown coming in from Chaknu. Him against the world! They don't have minions though! And he defends! Oh no! Nibor! That was the catch RSG really wanted. Now it's a goal signal coming in from Omega. They burst down Ira. Tempest of Blades. Nether Realm even unbothered for Omega as they try to work on the remaining members of the Raiders. And it looks like a triple kill coming in from Jome. And Omega will bring down the Raiders.